Hi everyone, it's Donna and I am speaking to you from our room at the Carnival cruise ship, the Liberty. We are in room 1268, which is on the very lowest level. I think the uh, crew is right below us. But the reason I like this level and the um, travel guide helped me get this level is because it's quieter down here. If you go any higher, it gets very, very noisy. And I'm going to show you our room. We have a um, just a window view. So I'm going to walk you through this room. Um, I've got my granddaughter in here and she's kind of trying to avoid everything. But I want to show you the room that's in these little closets. There's one here. There's another closet right here. And our bags have not been delivered yet. We got on board about two hours ago and sometimes it takes a while. So if you're going to take one of these cruises, uh, make sure you bring it on board what you're going to put on for a while because it could be up to 8 o'clock before we get our things. Now, you'll see these little banners hanging. I had the room decorated for Farah. They were supposed to deliver um, a plush, medium-sized plush, um, cat in the hat, um, oh, the cat in the hat book, and um, a picture frame, which they did. The, they also bring in four cookies and the uh, room service we <laughs> she's already eaten two of them and I helped her with a little bit now on the boat you can get water um, in your room okay you need to understand this water is not bottled water is not in the program the bubbles program that runs about six or seven dollars a day a little cheaper for kids but you can buy um, this water in the room it's 375 a bottle and they're huge bottles so I've already cracked one open because I think that it's worth it um, then you have a a, uh, a lock and you swipe your room key to lock it and unlock it here the television is right above it there's a vanity and mirror with a small chair a few drawers down here and a refrigerator down below there's nothing in the fridge. Ow! Sorry about that, guys. I don't see an ice maker, so there's no ice. Boom. Sorry. Then we come over here. We have some, I'm using this, these little shelves here on the side just for our shoes. You have some smaller cabinet space if you want to put toiletries or whatever. And then we come over here. We have, let's turn around here. We have a small chair, a bed, well, it's a, it's a uh, couch with some drawers be below it uh, that converts into a bed, a small coffee table. Here's the beach towel that was included in the package. I think it was $70 I paid for everything. Um, but I thought that beach towel was cute. These little banners are hooked on by a magnet so she can take these home with her and decorate her room with them. So. Then we have over here, we have our window. And I was expecting a small little window, um, but it is uh, very, really very big. Let me show you. We're still in port. We're getting ready to take off here in a few minutes. But I just kind of wanted to show you what's going on here a little bit. I think they're getting ready to, there's some guy, <laughs> hello down there, that's getting ready to take off. And then we have a bathroom. Now, if you're expecting a bathtub, at least in this room, there's not a bathtub. Um, it is compact, but they make good use. You can see how the door here opens up. Put the light on here. It has a shower. And we were laughing about this. I, she, my granddaughter wants to take a shower just so that she can use this right here. I said, you're gonna have to wait until we get a suitcase. There is a shower head that is detachable. No. Yeah, you have to do a handheld shower or you can hang it up on the little hook and just let it rain on you. Um, it looks like a camping toilet down here with a button. And good use of space here. There's a mirror up here on the wall, some, a lot of shelving. Really a great, whoever thought about the bathroom space did a great job because they, they went up higher so that you can put things, um, let's see here, 
Kleenexes, nice little sink, some soap, a couple little glasses over there. But um, basically, it is just um, a cute little room. Um, Farrah, do you want to say hi? Hi. Hey, we're here uh, three or four days, I think, maybe four days, three nights, something, four nights, three days. I don't know. I'm on the boat. I'm tired. Um, something to tell you is if you check in um, early, you better be prepared. They don't let you come into your room until 1.30 here. So if you are planning to come in and relax, you're going to have to go upstairs and you are going to have to wait until 1.30 before you can come downstairs and check out your room. So when you go upstairs, there's food, there's things going on upstairs, but it is extremely packed. Packed, packed, packed. Another thing I th would uh, like to have you bring is maybe, and I did bring one, but my suitcase isn't here yet, but this is our only plug. That is it, guys. Look at that. There's one tin for U.S. currents, and then there's the 220 for the European. And we have a telephone, but every time I try to call something, I can't get anybody. So. <laughs> and we have a lit vanity mirror. There we go. And I look terrible, you guys. I'm sorry if you're seeing me in this picture, but there's nothing I can do about it. Anyway, I just wanted to tell you that um, day one, I haven't... Um, oh, what's this over here? Let's take a look at that. If you want breakfast, there's a little thing you can pull off. A snoozing thing for privacy. You can just hang up on your door. Cool. If you want to order your breakfast in. Um, but anyway, what I'm trying to tell you guys is just be prepared when you walk in. You might check out some of the other videos. There's certain things you need to bring. Um, be prepared to... Uh, spend a little money. It's 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 not cheap once you get on board. We're going to go upstairs tonight and do a little shopping and check out some of the programs they've got going on and have dinner. So we have early dining at 6 p.m. Uh, so that we can get in and out of there and just start to enjoy the rest of the evening. Anyway, everybody take care out there and we will be taking off on this boat in about an hour, I think. So I will maybe shoot another video once we're out on the water and I'll show you some of the boat if I can get it a little quieter. I'm going to try. Can't promise it. So because this place is packed and I mean it is packed in here. So everyone take care and wish us luck on this boat. Oh, I hope it's not the U.S. Tit what is it? The Titanic? <laughs> Whatever it was. Anyway, take care. We'll talk to you soon. Please subscribe. Bye-bye.